ESC Radio, live from Berlin, and we made Chetward from Ireland here. Thanks to them, to you. Chad, I'm Edward. Okay, we are Chetward. J to the E to the D to the word. Planet Chetward. Okay, we're so excited. Okay, all to, to all Eurovision fans. Okay, you guys rock. Okay, and since Eurovision, we've been to Germany, we've been to Sweden, we've been all over the place, and we're right now we're doing a German tour. We're actually we're so, so thankful. And we heard like this amazing news that we won this award. We won the award, Eurovision Song Contest. I want to give Radio it a Chetward Best Group representing Ireland, the Eurovision Song Contest 2011. And guess where it was held? In Germany, it was amazing, Eurovision. And to all those other groups, okay, don't cry, okay, we were the best, okay, you, you were like second and third. We're the best groups, so that's really awesome that we got this award, okay, we're really excited, okay, because we love getting awards and the good sort of things, but we're really excited, but it's, it's kind of weird, okay, because me and John, I know like we won best group, but we're like twins, so we're not really a group, we're like a group from since we were born. But me and I, we don't take anything for granted, okay, we're really excited, and thanks for, for the award and all the fans who voted for us. We're going to get an award cabinet and put it in there with like our running trophies. We're gonna, but this award's going to be next to our Grammys and Oscars when we win those, okay? <laughs> but yeah. basically, um, me and I, okay, it's so cool that we did Eurovision in 2011, and we had so much fun with lipstick, and we're really excited because we're now on tour around Germany, and we're going to, we are on tour in Sweden, and then next year we're doing a Gerard Victory Tour, and we're going to be going all over Europe. Congratulations so, for winning this uh, award. It's Actually, cool. I... It looks like an ice cube, it's like glass it's like it's really cool this probably won't be the last award for you guys because uh, you might be up for uh, an award at, i don't know maybe yeah. next year because uh, lipstick has been in the chart for around 30 weeks i think <laughs> one of the most best-selling singles of the year probably no yeah, yeah it's, it's all it's all it's been really, really well okay the record labels are really happy with it okay and we're really excited because you go because you have a new album out called gerald victory and it's out now and our fans really, really like it there's like songs that like every superstar miss america get up and dance go get it they're all really, really high tempo fun tracks that all the people Blue, like lipstick. And guess what, guys? Okay, we could be doing Eurovision again next year. So <gasps> everyone vote for us. Yeah, I was about to ask about that. Well, first, let me ask about this year. Uh, did you do an enjoy? Did you regret uh, okay. to, that you've done that? No. This year's Eurovision has been insane. Okay, it, it, it means that me and John have gone to like all these different countries and like lipstick. It was like on iTunes, like number ones and everything. We're so thankful that we got the opportunity to do Eurovision. I think how cool it was, okay? Like a lot of people in Europe didn't even know who we were, okay? We got to meet Barack Obama after Eurovision. And we had like such a fun time, okay? And it's so cool because I think, I think we, we might go back, to, go back to Eurovision doing a bigger and better song Like next representing year. Ireland or Germany. So as a Brazilian, watch out! We could be representing Germany. Who knows? If Germany wants us, then we'll do it. And it's so cool because since June and Eurovision, we're in Bravo magazine. We're, all, we're in all the teen magazines. And we've got screaming girls all across Europe. And it's so cool when we go to shopping centers and everything. Everyone's like, Jedward, Jedward. We've got to see these signings. And it's just really, really great that, that um, Eurovision gave us that opportunity to, to, for all our fans to see us. What was actually your, fur, your personal favorite uh, among the songs from the competition this year? Um, um, my favorite was Estonia. Um, one, two, rock, rock, rock first. first street. Even though it, 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 it came glass. Came glass. Like, what the okay, hell? My favorite songs this year in Eurovision 2011 were was Estonia, Rock of Fair Street. I liked Exide, Popular. I liked A Friend in London. Come on. It's so cool, okay, because last time we did an interview like this. We I like were, Lena taking my straight. Last time we did this, we were in the competition and we didn't really say anyone was our favorite because we wanted to I like Norway as well. Habba Habba. Okay. Yeah. I want that to do really, really well. So, so what has happened? Meanwhile, your album, your second album came out, and what else? You have, you have toured. Did, uh, where where did, did you go after Eurovision? We did Big Brother for three weeks. We also had a second album, recording in our music video, recording music video, and now recording another music video. We did two tours, okay? We done film TV shows, recorded we're album. Recording, we're recording two TV shows in October, and um, yeah. We were really excited because it like, opened loads of new doors to us and, like, we're, and like, we're now like, all around Europe now. We've got like, loads of things to come. We're really excited about 2012 and all the things we're going to be doing for 2012. And all the Eurovision fans listening to this on Eurovision Radio. We've got loads of things coming. Everyone get excited. And everyone make sure to follow us on Twitter at Planet Cheddar. Oh, guess what? We nearly have 400,000 followers on Twitter. We nearly have 400,000 followers on Twitter. Oh, that's so bad. <laughs> Have you watched Eurovision every single year? Has yes, there ever been anyone like me and John? Well, actually, there was a twin couple in uh, 1980 representing Luxembourg, two girls. But uh, then again, there were uh, two Ages girls this year, too, from Slovakia. Did you, oh, yeah. did you meet oh, yeah, the girls yeah, yeah, from Slovakia? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that was, I like I that was well. twins were cool, but they were like way were more old than us. And yeah, we better. Them. I think they were cool. Okay? Yeah, it's, cool yeah. it's cool that, 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 that I'm all around Europe, all the girls and everybody and guys pick me now as their favorite twins. That's cool. I, uh, uh, twin war. I have to ask you about Johnny Logan because he 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 made a comment. Yeah, he was John, not really happy with you I, representing Ireland. Did you meet him in the sort of? No, we haven't met Johnny Logan yet, but like it's totally cool because our manager used to manage him, but he's not managing him anymore. I think Johnny Logan's a really really big fan. Okay, I think he was just he, he wanted to do it instead of us. Okay, but I think I think um like I think um, I think he was like going through a midlife crisis and he wanted to be in us and he's like old now. But we're cool, Johnny Logan. We're cool. You, you should do something together. Maybe <laughs> work together. We should definitely do a collaboration. Johnny Logan, uh, Jerry, we're free Johnny Logan. Uh, tell me what. Kind of music do you, do you like to listen to?
listen to in private? Uh, any, any recent downloads? What did you download? Uh, uh, our recent downloads were NSYNC, um, Jonas Brothers, yeah. um, like everybody, like all, all the latest music, Katy Perry, Lady Gaga, everybody, everyone, like all the rock bands, Red Sheep Peppers, all, all, like, like everybody, every type of music we listen to. Everyone and then who else? Like um, you know, and all the different artists. Like who's big over here? Like like Toko Tel. Like, they're really cool. Yeah, the guy at Toko Tel's dyed his hair. Yeah, like us. the lead singer at Toko Tel, Bill at Toko Tel, now has his hair like me and Edward. So that's really really cool. That we we were fans of Toko Tel before Eurovision, and we had like we had like blonde hair. Now he's got blonde hair. So that's really really cool that we can. We're like triplets now. You're famous for your hairstyle. Uh, do you do you ever discuss maybe to change your hairstyle? Because many acts change their, especially the hairstyle, hairdo over the years. So uh, is there any concept for a new? Had to. <laughs> well, basically, okay, before Eurovision, me and John had our hair like it wasn't like a Eurovision gimmick thing. It was like it was like us, like where our hair always is like. But maybe we might change if we start losing our hair or whatever. I think me and I, <laughs> I think me and I, um, like right at the moment, okay, our fans really, really like our hair. They don't want us to change because it totally makes us completely different, and like nobody has. Uh, on your tour, where will you go after this? After Germany? We are. Well, it's, it's, I think it's we got we're, January. It starts again in January, so we go to Germany and then we go to Sweden. We're doing then. a brand new tour. We're, in gonna, we're, going to, we're going to Austria, Switzerland. And we're going to go all the different we're countries. We're going to Norway, Russia, because we got lots of fans in Russia. Yeah, now. we were meant to go to Russia like. Um, it's really cool. Okay, we meant to go to Russia a week and a half ago, and basically the show was postponed because we did loads of your because we did Eurovision. Now it kind of brought attention to us. So like then, like got loads of girls found out all our other songs. So it's cool they now know all our songs. And like all the YouTube videos that we used to be on YouTube are now like thousands of hits. Like like, like loads of views. Yeah, crazy. Okay, guys. So thank you very much for this. Congratulations again for Thanks, winning this guys. award. Better than all the other groups. Okay, I'm John. I'm Edward. I'm John Hees, Aaron Scary, Art, Jedward, and we're so thankful for you guys giving us the Eurovision Song Contest Radio Best Group Award. Jedward is genius. And hope to see you again in the Eurovision. Yes, it'd be amazing. Okay, we come back bigger and better, a massive song. So all of the Eurovision acts, watch out. And everyone vote for us, okay? We want you guys to make us win. Okay, thanks, guys. Bye for now. <laughs>